Hey everyone, it's CR7 here and welcome to this weekend's post-race style to recap video from Daytona. And it was a very crazy uh, regular season finale. As you can see, I got my race notes with me. Uh, I'm not sitting in a chair this time. So we're going to get right into it with uh, stage one ha having nothing happening whatsoever. And Martin Truex Jr. took the stage victory. Let me adjust the camera a little bit. Yes, there's a die cast right here. And then stage two begins at lap 41. And then uh, green flag pit stops at around lap 81 and 82. And on the final lap lap of stage two, the first, of many, the first big wreck of the evening was Ryan Blaney getting turned into the outside wall hard by uh, Ty Gibbs, who got hooked by his teammate Christopher Bell. And... Four cars were collected in it. Uh, AJ Allmendinger, Tyler Reddick, Austin Sindrick, Austin Dillon, Ty Gibbs, Alex Bowman, Stenhouse, Harvick, Christopher Bell, Riley Herbst in the 36 car, Brendan Poole who hit the inside wall, Kyle Larson, Denny Hamlin, and Chris Buescher, I, th I do believe. And that resulted in Brad Keselowski winning stage two and they red flagged the race to clean everything up. Then the final stage begins at lap 105. And then the final wave of green flag pit stops with 17 to go. And just when you thought that they could run to the white flag, a massive accident happened with Ryan, Ryan, Please, uh, Ryan Priest getting turned on the backstretch. He blows over and then catches the grass and starts tumbling wildly down the back straightaway. It was a very scary wreck indeed, but... He did climb out of the car, but they took him to a local med medical center. That's all the information that that I have right now. Uh, I will post on the community tab about Ryan Priest's condition. Uh, again, he did climb out of the car, but was transported to a local medical center for further evaluation. So uh, best wishes go to Ryan Priest. Uh, my, pr my prayers are with him tonight, and I do hope he is all right after that big tumble. So that's the biggest wreck we've seen with the next gen car thus far. And I kind of had a feeling it would happen with the car catching the grass and then start tumbling, cartwheeling through the air and all that. So definitely a very scary wreck. I'm glad to see he got out of the car, but best wishes to him right now. I really hope he's all right. And I do hope he comes back for Darlington. So that resulted in the first overtime attempt and Chris Buescher survives the chaos and picks up RFK's first win at Daytona in nine years. And Bubba Wallace may, makes the playoffs and also Chase Elliott missed the playoffs, unfortunately. So yeah, that is my race notes. It's only one page. Now to my personal thoughts on the race. It was a very crazy race. Uh, um, we saw the big one, a wild flip, and RFK's resurgence uh, continuing on. So um, again, I will post on the community tab to update you on Ryan Priest's condition. I, again, best wishes to him. I hope he's all right after that scary tumble. So yeah, uh, that caps off uh, tonight's post-race thoughts and recap video. Stay tuned for tomorrow for the CR7 Fleet Car Series Sunday edition. So that'll do it for this video. Subscribe for more and I'll see you in the next one. Bye-bye.